With each look to the scoreboard, sip of water, and sigh, Appleton East coach John Milkey was having an inner struggle. It, it was tough for me personally just to, just to, to sleep at night and, and just realize that we were going to have to play these guys. Milkey spent 15 seasons at Antigo, taking the Red Raiders to state in 1995. If I was in his position, I don't know, it'd be it'd just tough because he'd be a really strong connection to that community. Now he's got to come here and we've got to play them. He's probably got a lot of friends and stuff still there, and it's hard to like take them down, but I'm sure he's probably a little happy we beat him. <laughs> I knew it was going to be a tough game for him because he had so many ties to Anago, but it's a state tournament, and I know he prepared hard like he always does, and he wanted us to get the win, and he definitely helped us achieve that. Antigo's leading scorer, Jordan Mock, met Milky in the first grade. He's appreciated his support since. Coach Milky, I've known him for a long time, and we've always had a really good relationship, and he just kept telling me I had a great season and tried to keep it going in my college career. Thus, the Patriots' quarterfinal win is bittersweet for Milky. It was tough to, to have to play them, to be honest with you. And, you know, I, I, normally I feel great, but I, I, I do, if I'm being honest, I've, I've got a tinge of sorrow that their season had to come to an end, especially at our expense. Now Coach Milky can breathe a giant sigh of relief and get the Pats ready for the semifinal. He'll also likely sleep a little easier tonight. In Madison, Paige Pearson, Fox 11 Sports.